All right, everyone, welcome back to another one of Miami. Today we're at Art of Attack here in Rancho Cucamonga, and um, I can with full confidence say that this is going to be the biggest uh, Civic Type R uh, FKA meet in all of Southern California. I mean, just pulling in, there's so many beautiful cars like that one. Probably my favorite color, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, but yeah, I mean, man, I don't even know where to look. There's just so many nice cars. And this is the street, by the way. We haven't even made it to the shop. I literally, there's no parking. So I had to go all the way in the other side um, to park um, over there by myself. But um, man, there's just so many cars that are grabbing my attention right off the bat. Some of these cars I've seen before, some I have not. Um, you guys know how I feel about the Type R. I really like them. Um, but I don't know if... Uh, I don't know what the, the, the reason why, but I never really seriously thought about pulling the trigger on one except one of these ones, this color or yellow. But then after looking at the prices, he's probably gonna park here. I'm trying not to get run over. Yep, he's gonna park right here. Um, looking at the prices on that color, it just, it's just pretty wild, man. Good morning. It's just too expensive for my taste. Um, I don't know if it's because of a Honda or whatever the case may be. I don't know, uh, but I'm not gonna pay 50 grand for for a Type R, and that's what it was going for uh, at the last dealership where I went. Uh, there was a I don't know what you call those Hyper Blue. Let me stay quiet so you can listen to the cars. Yeah, we all want to hear the cars instead of me mumbling but i don't know man i just couldn't justify paying you know 45 plus for a type r and ah whatever but they, they look extremely aggressive you know uh especially the front end i really really like it um and then uh i really really like the sonic gray pearl um if i'm not mistaken that is the name on this one so this will be you know before the blue and the yellow came out this was definitely the color that i would have wanted to get if i was serious about getting a type r it would have been this color um very similar to jackie um no i didn't get jackie's color because of this one um i got it off a uh, anvil anvil jeep wrangler but they put a little bit more gray so that's why it looks like cement gray but as you guys can tell this thing is packed Packed is an understatement, um, and type parts everywhere, man. It's pretty cool. It's nice to see all the. It, it, it's interesting to see that like, they're all the same car, but the different taste and different, um, you know, route that the owners decided to go with. One of my favorite uh, wings on the type parts, the Jays little wrap here very nice very very nice tease because why not it just fills the, the wheel gap very nicely and that's not to say that if you pay 50 grand for a type R that you're wrong it's just I personally wouldn't um, so don't take it if you're watching this and randomly came across this video and think like that guy's a jerk um oh my god i gotta show some love for the ek but man this one right here oh Woo. oh yes wow man those wheels those wheels and tire setup it's perfect very very proper i i would probably go with something like this this would be the setup that i would go with the rigas Or some of you, you're gonna get mad if I say the the Rotas. I'll get off your shot, man. Sorry. This is beautiful, champ white. Ooh, again going back. It's the same car, but look at the different, you know, things that they go with. Uh, you guys can't see the interior, but that roll bar slash cage is well, it's cage, I think. It looks very nice, very aggressive. Let's see if I can get it from the back. Ah. Oh so beautiful so so beautiful but that one 
right there that one's very nicely done very aggressive I will definitely come back and take some pictures of it but I saw something that kind of caught my eye you guys know how we are you know in the 90s so even though there's a whole bunch of brand new type parts <laughs> this is the one that caught my eye um, wow so beautiful wheel wood brake kit tees automotive anatomy man I knew that was you <laughs> what's up man it's my car right here this one yeah damn this is badass dude I'm trying to get on there let me know shoot me a DM I'm not from here where are you from San Jose are you just here to visit yeah, I'm here with my boy. Uh, yes, man. Nice to meet you. Chris. Yeah, I'll be watching all your shit, dude. I appreciate that, man. Yeah, I knew you. I was like, yeah, it's got to This is out of my room. <laughs> um, yeah, man. How long are you in town for? Till tomorrow morning. Till tomorrow morning? Yeah. What time are you guys dipping back? 6 a.m. 6 a.m.? Yeah. Damn, super early. Yeah. Yeah, shoot me a DM, man. We'll make it happen, though, for sure. Yeah, anytime you come into NorCal. I know you did all those videos, like, day Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is beautiful. Want to see the hood? Yeah, hell yeah! We want to see the hood. <laughs> so this is Chris, the owner of this beautiful EG that caught our attention. Came from the bay, so thank you, man. I appreciate it. Yeah. Oh my gosh! Oh my goodness, dude! This thing is beautiful. How long have you had it for? Um. I started building a year ago and I finished it like two months ago. Wow. I think this is gorgeous, man. How much How much are you pushing? 250. Just stock 2.0, uh, built head, cams, uh, RBC, ported RBC, DJI header. You can check your inside out too. Yeah, man, that's for sure. Oh, man, I wish you were in town. I would have definitely, uh, we should have set something up. Get the whole entire story. Oh, I gotta go this time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he is a Honda owner. Badass engine can open the door. <laughs> oh man, this thing is mint. Man, this thing is mint. Look at this. Again. Ah, okay, good. Ooh, suede on the door panels. Wow. Again. The 90s, man. This is this is what we like. Oh my God, this is a treat, man. I didn't expect this, dude. This is freaking awesome. Thank you. Wow, very beautiful. I almost missed it. Exit exhaust. Oh my God. I'm not trying to uh, show all his secrets. Oh man, this is beautiful though. Oh, I didn't even know this car existed. Oh, we're gonna make it happen. We're gonna definitely drive up there. This is so cool. Thank you, Chris. I really appreciate it, man. A right, big shout out to Chris who allowed us to see his uh, beautiful K20 swap EG. Total race car. I'm gonna give him a little bit of hard time. I'm gonna meet up with him. I, I know I am. I am gonna go up and to the bay to uh, meet up with some of you guys and interview some, some cool cars. Cause obviously, that's what I keep hearing, man. Oh, cars up in the north, or the, the, I don't know. There's, I guess there's not the same culture as down here, but I feel like no one has stepped up. That's the problem. There's a lot of beautiful cars out there. You just gotta have to, oh, you know, people show up and they're reckless. What's well, because that's the people that you're accepting. Start small and then eventually, eventually it'll continue to grow. But everybody wants an Eibach type of, sorry. Everybody wants an Eibach type of vibe their first time around and then expect you know people not to act you know foolish no you gotta you gotta create the culture you gotta start small oh wow this is beautiful beautiful love that tire setup and wheel as i already mentioned it but yeah i gotta give chris a hard time because he was like oh this is a automotive academy <laughs> not academy for <laughs> anatomy no but big shout out to him and thank you so much for allowing me to excuse me um allowing me to see that k20 i think it's beautiful man so gorgeous so yeah man uh i'm definitely gonna try to make it up there because uh, i've been getting a few dms if we can get some look this is the thing this the whole interview thing it, it, it's fun i'm not gonna go all the way in there just because of the the music i can hear myself <laughs> you guys know how much i like to hear myself we'll see F it, we're going in. We'll see what kind of cars they have in there. 
I do apologize if you guys can't hear me or the music is too loud. I have no control over that. I'm sure they save some of the best parts for the inside. So we'll see. So again, big apologies if the music is very loud. Very nice. Super nice. Very crowded, that's for sure. Very, very, very crowded. Good morning. Good morning, senor. How are you? Nice little setup right here with the both type bars. Very, very beautiful. Hey, you know what? Like, just like last time I got so much um, so much hate. Let me get off their shots. They actually have professional gear. You know, God forbid my little GoPro gets in front of them. <laughs> um, I know I'm gonna get so much hate for this, but I'll take the old Civic Type R over the new one. I said it, I don't care. <laughs> this is gorgeous. From what I've heard, this car did not come out, hasn't come out in a long, long time. So this is definitely a treat for all of us. And yeah, this thing is immaculate. Very, very beautiful. Very, very beautiful. Let me get off. Yeah, it was super worth it to come in. <laughs> Very aggressive uh, Type R Jose. Beautiful, beautiful. Very fast driver. Even better car. Let me get off his shot. It's so hard not to get on people's shots. So crowded in here. Speaking of another very beautiful car, K Series, right hand drive. Very, very beautiful. Gorgeous. So, yeah, definitely a lot of nice cars. I realize I'm getting old because um, I like subtleness now. <laughs> I like, you know, quiet, chill and mellow. Music is cool and all, but then it just, I think it disrupts, it disrupts the, the flow of um, just being able to just kind of chill and, and sit there. But again, that's because I'm old. It has nothing to do with the actual me. Pretty cool vibes though. This guy, um, I forgot his, uh, his Instagram last time and I still forgot it right now, but he's from the Bay. He just moved to Southern Cali. That's why I was tripping out because I was like, I thought he was in the Bay, but he's in Southern Cali now. So he's definitely taking advantage of, you know, the, the, the meats here. This is beautiful. Oh my gosh. See, again, this is a, uh, I know T's are played out. I said it, but the spoon wheels, the Riga masters, they're played out as well, but I'll take them over the T's. Yeah, I said it. I'm gonna get so much hate on this video. <laughs> Very beautiful. Man, it's just, this car is just, I haven't seen that many type R's. Ooh, look at this upgrade on the brake kit. Oh, very subtle. And over here hiding, oh. Again, 90s, man. 90s is the way to go. Look at this one, just hiding in the little corner. Gorgeous. Very, very nice. Really like the way this one looks. Got it on top of that. Ah, love it. So yeah. Um, so like I mentioned, you guys, I wasn't, I, I'm not, I never really took it, um, you know, it was, the Type R was never the car that I was like, oh, man, I can't wait to go get it. However, I was, what, what was it? I was $2,000 away from buying one. Um, man, it was a while back, can't remember. But, um, the, at the time, it was like maybe like a year, a year since the Type R had come out. Joe is John with his R32. And, um, oh, this is a homie. Bosses hiding in the corner. Ooh, mix match wheels. I saw that. Red and black, or hyper silver, whatever you want to call it. 
R32. What's up, brother? How are you? Good, 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 good. Just chill, man. Just chill, man. Just chill, man. It's a, it's a warm day. It is a warm day. More type bars. Very beautiful. Oh, the, the black one. The black one looks great too. So, like I was saying, um, I don't know, it was like a year into the cars coming out. At the time, I didn't know how many, you know, type bars that were gonna be, you know, made. I thought it was gonna be a very low number of cars. And um, I went to the dealer, checked one out. They wanted, oh man, I'm, I know they wanted, how much? 10 grand over MSRP and I was like no man I'm not gonna be paying 10 grand over MSRP um, I think I, I said I'll, I'll go up to 6,000 MSRP it was a black one it was gorgeous and um, they're like oh no man if you can come up to 8 we'll let it go and I was just like no man like there's no way I already feel embarrassed saying that I'm gonna pay over you know 6 grand over MSRP long story short I didn't get it I ended up getting the Super STI STI was cool too but um yeah, I mean, some people, from what I've heard in the on the forums, they pay 20 grand over MSRP. Of course, no one's gonna go in and talk about that, which is fine. Um, I think it, it comes back to that. However, it is worth however how much you think is worth, and somebody will go in and pay that amount, which is fine. I don't. But yeah, for me, six grand was a little too much, and they wanted me to go up to eight, make it all these guys shot, and I was like, nah, man. That's just a little too much, you know. But you know, to some people, some people is worth it, and I keep hearing great reviews about it. Um, but very nice. Ooh. Very nice. So many nice cars. Nice wingless type R. Hmm, interesting. For me, the, the wing has to go with the Type R. It's just kind of like the Subaru. Sure, you can get it without the wing, but... Eh, como decimos en español, algo no cuadra. Something's not right about it, you know? I think the Type R just belongs with the wing. This generation, you know? But that's just my opinion. I drive in a court. What do, you, what do I know, right? Just ignore me. <laughs> but yeah, man, I mean... Pretty nice cars. Um, I like the setup that they did inside with the two um, the two yellow type bars. I think that's pretty cool. Oh, it's different though. For the four door daycare showed up with his Civic. Dude, I'm still saying the 80s and 90s are still in the show. Even all these new cars here, they're still still in the show. I'll go get. Uh, Nice. It's getting so crowded. This is beautiful though, right here. It's very beautiful. That fitment though. This is Evan uh, Gills, if I'm not mispronouncing his last name. Look at that finish. Very nice and clear, clean interior. Very few cars can rock that brown or tan interior and this is definitely one, one that can.